For a second day straight, Israeli airstrikes have hit a Gaza refugee camp. The Israeli government believes that camp was being used by Hamas militants. This is what that refugee camp looks like now. It's been reduced to a pile of rubble. The airstrikes also destroyed several apartment buildings. Hamas says the airstrikes killed and wounded a lot of civilians in today's assault, although there's still not a clear um, ex exact toll on the number of people that were involved. It also comes a day after airstrikes took out a top Hamas commander linked to the October 7th attack that sparked the war. Earlier this morning, we had the chance to speak with the Israeli Consul General to the West Southwest region of the U.S. about the goals of the Israeli airstrikes against Hamas. I think it's very important to remember the objectives of the war that was imposed on us. We, we remained with no choice. And this, the objectives of the war are very simple and straightforward. Dismantle the Hamas terrorist infrastructure from the Gaza Strip. This is what we're talking about. This is not about revenge. We are not God forbid, a bloodthirsty nation. This is about keeping the Israeli population safe. And the only way we will be able to do that is dismantle the terrorist uh, infrastructure from Gaza. And this is exactly what we are doing. You can see our entire conversation with the Council General on our website, wwltv.com.